Looking back at the highlights of the first of two races here at Mategi. It was a clean start from Kang Ling in the 29 Audi from Phantom Pro Racing, but a brilliant start from third to second, albeit hitting the curbs. Andrew Harianto going past Jin Long Bao. And then those two absolute Porsches settled into third and fourth position with Vutikorn in through Fubisak, the championship leader, in behind. Talking of behind, his behind was clipped by his teammate. He just moved ahead. And unfortunately, Jing Long Blau, civil war. But this was a far bigger moment. Chris on cheer, taking out one. No, both of the RB racing Porsches. He picked up a drive through penalty for that, but didn't get back as far as that at all. The car was damaged and out of the race. The sister car, however, was being driven beautifully by Kang Ling. But as the first stint went on, the gap went out a little bit, but it came back to just three seconds as he was hunted down by Andrew Harianto. And then immediately after the, the pit stops, the number 11 car went ahead. That was James Yu. He picked off the 29 car, and Cao Chi could do nothing about it. In fact, he would fall to an eventual ninth place overall. Still took class victory in the silver class. But coming up the order all the time, Yuta Kamimura, the eight, number 18 Porsche Center, Okazaki Porsche, being challenged very hard indeed by the Kraft Bamboo Racing Mercedes of Fabian Schiller. That had extra time at the pit stop, but it was the battle for about sixth place downwards that became very, very muscular indeed. The Mizawa Racing Ferrari hanging on with Nyoko Yokomitsu being hunted all the time by Lucas Stoltz. Frankie Cheng in the mix as well. It was close, it was exciting, and turn 11 was where it all happened unless they'd had an assault up at turn 10. there have been plenty of those. But as it went to the finish, hanging the tail out a little bit, wagging the tail of the dog, a very happy dog. And it was uh, James Yu taking victory. First blood to Audi here at Mateki.